Let's go over these three multiple choice questions about the nucleus. Here's the easy question. What is the primary function of the nucleus in eukaryotic cells? The reason why this is an easy question is basically it's just asking you whether or not you've memorized the function of the nucleus. A, to produce ATP from cellular respiration. No, that's the mitochondria. B, store and protect genetic information. That sounds like the right answer. C, modify and package proteins. No, that would be the Golgi body. D, break down old organelles. No, that would be the lysosome. And then E, transport vesicles throughout the cytoplasm. That would be like the cytoskeleton. So the correct answer here is B, store and protect genetic information. Here's the medium question. Which type of molecule does the nucleolus make? Remember we have the nucleus and then within the nucleus we have this region called the nucleolus. It has a specific job to make something called rRNA. This is a medium difficulty question because a lot of students forget the role of rRNA and this rRNA is part of the ribosomes which are going to be needed outside of the nucleus. So, so the answer here is E, rRNA. And here's the hard question. Which statement about the nucleus is false? A, the nuclear envelope has two membranes. That's correct. The nucleus has two membranes, so this one's not the answer. B, the nuclear membrane contains holes called pores. That's right. That's how the mRNA leaves the nucleus. C, prokaryotic cells lack a nucleus. That's correct. They don't have a nucleus. D, it's the site of protein synthesis. No, that's the ribosome, and we don't have functioning ribosomes in the nucleus, so D looks like our answer. E, the nucleus makes parts of ribosomes. We just went over that. It makes rRNA, which makes up a ribosome, so that is not the answer, which means D here is the correct answer.